Okay, what we're going to do here in this little video is uh, actually make a, a solid block, and this will be one of three uh, little short lessons that we will do uh, concerning normal surfaces of a plain, ordinary uh, cube, or like a pair of dice, uh, an inclined plane, and an oblique plane. Okay, so this will go under the normal uh, surfaces. We click New. We click Part, we click OK, and we want to do the front, so we click on Front, we click on Sketch, then we're going to do a rectangle, we click on the corner rectangle, center spot, there, now then we're going to click on Escape, and what we want to do, we want to give some depth to this so we're going to click on the extrude boss and then we just grab a hold of that little arrow and we make uh, whatever uh, dimension we want right, right now it's irrelevant we're just showing how to uh, go through the formalities to do that we click the uh, green arrow button and now then we have a solid cube uh, each one of these three surfaces that we can see are surfaces that are normal to each other. All right. And if we were interested in looking at the uh, different, the six orthographic projection views, you can see here we that shows it rotates and zooms the model to the top. This one will sh just show us the front. This one will just show us the side. Okay. So let's click on these right quick. Let's look at the top. Okay, that shows us the top, and we want to see the front. Now, this is kind of simple, but if there were some complicated features there, okay, this would be important to us. Okay, and that's, and now then there's one other thing here. Well, let's take a look at this one. This sh shows us what we call wireframe, looking at it from that particular view, or we could uh, have hidden lines. Okay, this just shows us the solid without being shaded in. If we're interested in looking at the hidden lines that are there, we can click on that one. And if we're just the solid lines without the hidden lines, we will do that one. All right. But here, let's see, we will click on, let's see, which one is this to finish? Okay that one right there. That's the way we'll finish it. Solid. Okay, so that's the end of this little video and the next one will show you how to create an inclined plane. All right.